your greatest asset isn't how much money you have or your house. It's you. You matter, and you're awesome. Don't fight us on this one. Ask your friends. Visit BetterHelp.com slash DIYS and take care of your number one with some online therapy because you deserve to invest in your greatest asset, you. What up, everybody? I'm to hear more. And I'm Patrick Cloud. And this is another episode of Damn Internet, You're Scary. Actually, you know what? Let me get Lou to say it again. And this is another episode of Damn Internet, You're Scary. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's Listen, the sound uh, like. very excited show. First of all, we got two guests. Yeah. On there, all right. And we, we typically don't do this. Super guests. So uh, one is Lulu Gonzalez, the comedian, actor, creator, content creator, and just phenom all the way around. Yeah, no. And the first time ever we have my sister from another oh, mister, Miss Meg Scoop. Hey what up, Scoop? What's up? I'm glad to be here. I be watching all y'all's episodes like, mm, I want to go there. <laughs> I would like to talk I to a mic. Go there. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to talk about how scary the internet is. Right. <laughs> my turn, welcome, guys. Yeah. Well, we're glad that you're here, Meg. We're glad yeah. that you're in town. Meg is obviously in town working, so she took time out of her work day. Or actually, this she's supposed to be relaxing right now. So we just finished up, and she came out to hang with us or stuck around and hang yes. with us. But I really think she stuck around because we're doing lunchtime lottery right after this, mm-hmm. and we're ordering all types of desserts. All mm-hmm. the desserts. There you go. All right, well, at you least we know. desserts. Y'all got to pay me with something. Food is it. <laughs> I mean, desserts. We, we pay our guests now. Mm-hmm. No, mm-hmm. I just wanted desserts. I didn't. <laughs> yeah, I, said, I, I, I didn't need the actual that. cash. I, I heard desserts, dessert. and I was like, I'm gonna stay too. Right, I right. mean, <laughs> like, y'all paying for desserts? Here? Cool. You ain't gotta ask me. Cause I was gonna get my own ice cream after I left. I was like, y'all paying for it? I guess I gotta stay. <laughs> might, as, might as well. <laughs> Take a gamble man. on the lottery. Right, hey, right. You ain't gotta twist my arm. Man. We're very fun to eat with, so you guys yeah. should be fine. It's gonna be <laughs> great, man. Um, yeah, thank y'all for coming. And uh, yeah, we we had a busy day already. We shot four episodes of Squadcast. Well. Me and Meg did. Uh, Lulu came in on the last episode, and Pat just just rolled up because moseyed he was stuck, on in, stuck in uh, Santa. Uh, where were you San, at? San, San, San Francisco. Francisco was a uh, mm. small frail bodcon. <laughs> small went... frail bodcon. It was all the guys, all the grown men that wear extra small tank tops. So <gasps> yeah. it was in oh, there. I would have loved to have been there. <laughs> <laughs> You think for extra small? I mean, put a couple in my pocket to keep it moving. Uh, uh, a couple dudes? Yeah. Take, get it to go he had, top on. he had a rubber band behind it to make it even smaller. Right. It was a lot of fun. I saw the pictures. Uh, How was it, man? How it's was not it? a real place, guys. It's not? <laughs> no hotel would rent that out. <laughs> I just bet you a whole bunch of dudes in Hawaiian shirts. And <laughs> <laughs> no, like loose baggy tank tops. Yeah, just walking around like, hey, man. And very small good. fellas, man. They, and where you get that? Where they, you get that tank top? They keep their credit cards in their backpacks. <laughs> And their fanny packs are yeah. I miss San Francisco a little bit. Really? <laughs> I should have been. I should have stayed. <laughs> I know the panels she was really looking for. I was having it today, huh? Uh, yes. <laughs> How to fight off uh, guys who are bigger than you? No panels <laughs> lead into Mondays, guys. We all know this. How to divert attention from your small I'm frail not body? I'm not frail. Okay. <laughs> Check it out. You're petite. Yeah. You're petite. I've That's never the reason. Yeah, I mean, that is... We refer to it as petite. It's a little something there. I mean, you got muscles, but you're still petite. Yeah, you still... <sighs> Look at this. Look how tall uh, I am. Girls be picking Pat up by his waist and moving behind him. Like, here, get behind me. <laughs> like, if there was a fight right now somehow, I'd be like, Pat, I got you, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'd feel safe, too. Actually, I would let Lulu fight for me, too. <laughs> no, I was about to say, I'd feel hella safe. Me, too. I would let Lulu fight Lulu's for me, Lulu's a veteran. <laughs> She's learned how to kill people with a toothpick, so I am... Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely Who going... Who am I, John Wick? Hey, man. <laughs> She's the only, uh, uh, it's not going to work. Okay, Pat. I'm still too hurt by everything else. Okay. I was like, yes, let's move on to making fun of someone else. I'm still broken inside. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm so uh, I'm inside. seeing a lot of reggae, and I saw doo-wop and then doo-wop? 90s rap. Doo-wop. Is that like poodle skirts? Yeah, like... Sadie Hawkins dance. 50s? Yeah. Like 50s? Sadie Hawkins dance? Yeah. I'm going to ask you to the dance. <laughs> That's mm-hmm. weird. We had a Sadie Hawkins dance when I was growing up. Yeah. Everybody they kept it going. Yeah, they had them. I oh. had them. Had, we had oh, that we, in New York. Yeah, we had them in Kentucky. And we did not have Sadie that in Hawkins. New York. But it Who's was weird that? because nobody really asked anybody. The girls wasn't really asking guys. Who's it was Sadie? just another... D- I don't know. Maybe the most bold woman in the world during the fifties. <laughs> yeah. She was like, she was, a, she was hey, the first Johnny. woman that was like, you want to go to the dance? sock hop with me? The sock <laughs> hop. And the girl was like, oh my god, I have never seen a woman oh, ask out a man. God. 
Who is that? That's the late great Sadie Hawkins. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to see who this is. Go- Google it. Look, okay, here it goes. Sadie Hawkins. Sadie Hawkins, uh, informer, blah, 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 history. Okay, here we go. <laughs> it's named after the Lil Abner comic strip character, Sadie Hawkins. Uh, in the strip, Sadie Hawkins' day fell on a given day in November. The unmarried woman of Dog Patch got to chase the bachelors and marry up with the ones that they caught. Okay, not really for kids, but <laughs> <laughs> wait, what? So hey, basically, I'm like, if you grab a man and you can have him and he's yours, like, that's like that's a like reverse me too. Ooh, right. I would be so good at that. I would trade oh all year just for November. <laughs> But that's wild. It's like Hunger Games for marriage. Like you're you're chasing these people, and if you catch one, you marry up. That's a quotes. good sketch. I want to shoot that. Hey, man. I, was to, I thought you said a good idea. I was that like, that's is. assault. I mean, you got to be a kidnapping. Fast, you would be good at that. That's what I'm saying. I would Girl. train all Girl. year, just for November. Cause like, you know like, that because oh, you can catch whoever you want. Yo, you be like, so oh man, you didn't want to talk to me in May, nigga. Wait till November. <laughs> that's how you gonna punish him. Because you train. Oh, now we gotta get married. <laughs> now we gonna get married. Oh, you didn't want to take me out. Now we gonna get married. Oh, d- just wait. November's wait, wait. coming. You, you just mind. wait. Ooh, you now he's training to run away from you. <laughs> training all year. <laughs> we both training. Uh-uh. <laughs> Who knew? Let's uh, let's let's. Are y'all going to the reggae or? Someone put KRS one. That's not even a genre. <laughs> <laughs> they said nineties hip hop, and then yeah, Ugh, I do not like KRS one. You don't. Yo, 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 it's KRS. I don't even know how to do this work. The voice. bridge is over. The <laughs> bridge is over. <laughs> put a bye bye. All right. So, <laughs> then what are we feeling? Reggae? Yeah, let's, let's do reggae. Okay. Oh, shit. Reggae. Right. Uh, so typically, I mean, Lou, you know how this goes, but Meg, we, one of us makes the beat, the other person kind of just creates the track. Uh, and then the guests kind of get in where they fit in, either with a verse or with a chorus. And typically, when we're writing, uh, or, you know, rapping or singing the the verse. We just try to rhyme scary with Mary, Harry, binary, non dairy, uh, judiciary. Judici- <laughs> <laughs> that has not happened yet. That is new. It's going to happen today. <laughs> judiciary. Uh, you did the beat last time, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'll do the beat this time, and then okay. I'll let you kick it off, and then Lou and uh, uh, Meg can hop okay. in, get in where they fit in. I guess. All right. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see. What beat we gonna go with? Do you need uh, a lighter? For what? Just. The- yeah, Put the, your light. The, yeah. Hey, wait, can, oh, can we yeah, change the colors that. to no, red, oh. yellow, and oh, green? <laughs> well, why do we, we don't have to do all of that for just this, <laughs> yes, man. Yes, we do. Oh, my God. Meg is for I, sure a producer. She comes in and just takes over. <laughs> she, she looks straight at sure like, can I get a... Uh, oh, man. Color, color, color. All right. I like that, that. That gives me some time to think of a song. Red, uh, yellow, How are you going to do this blue. reggae beat? Uh, I mean, yellow. Um, we usually rip songs off. It's the quickest way to do it. Uh-huh. Mm. Dang, I'm, I'm having a hard time thinking of a reggae song. Uh... Okay, yeah. Does that give you, that give you some? Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. <laughs> Are you sure? Did that have a question Are mark you? on it? <laughs> <laughs> the inflections of... Uh, how, how's, how I got shot the sheriff go? Shot the I'm trying to think of the Almost all of them are jumped, jumped, jumped. But it always is starts with that drum roll. Okay. That I'm feeling. Well, that's more of the words. <laughs> I'm trying to give you the whole of it. I can't think of anything right now, Pat. See, he got words. Yeah, I'm just really good with the I can't think of anything. Mm-hmm. Also, is this marijuana? Yes, yes. <laughs> Draw from your braids. Draw from your braids. All right. <laughs> pull, a, pull an instant out. It <laughs> <laughs> feels like cedar wood, lemon. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Ready? Grop, go, go, go. Boom, jumped, boom, jumped, 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 Mingo over my homeboy house. It was Harry. 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 Me walk to the alley, man, and it was scary. Scary. Me call up my homegirl. Her name is Mary. 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 Boom, jump, me boom, go to jump, the store boom, to go get boom, some dairy. Jump, <laughs> boom, jump, 
Boyaka, Boyaka, Boom, Jump, Me call up this girl, her name was Meg. We hopped on her back because it was Meg. Jump, 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 We had no problem getting to the store. Boom, Jump, Boom, Jump, Boom, Jump, She held on tight, Jump, She wanted some more, Jump, But damn, Jump, Jump, at the end of that is scary, scary. Jump the boom, jump the, the boom, internet jump, is scary, boom, scary. Jump, pull up, jump, I call up jump, my boy boom, Barry. Jump, Boom, jump, boom, jump, I said the boom, internet is scary. Boom, jump, boom, jump, scary. Scary. Boom, jump, boom, jump, boom, boom, jump, That's boom, that's jump, all I got. Boom, <laughs> jump, <laughs> Where were y'all? I love it. We did. I did the alley. Okay, okay. I was still the bitches in the back. I had a beat. Background, background beat. You're a little tambourine in there. <laughs> ah, we are well on our way. Um, Pat, I know you got some craziness. Actually, Pat, oh, you yeah. asked us a crazy uh, question while we were about to start recording the last yes. episode of Squadcast. Okay, which what, was it? That was the how many partners do you think you could have in one 24-hour block? Oh, yes. What? No, you said a woman because it is different, I would say. She, um, yeah, someone, someone broke. More. Oh, well, did, did you did you know the final answer? She went in here. Yes. No, you no, were no. though, right? You know what happened? Yes. yes. You heard yes. it. Let's talk about it. All right. So, uh, a lovely young lady um, broke the record for most sexual partners in one day. Twenty-four mm-hmm. hour period. Twenty-four what, hours. What was the number? What, what would you What would you think? Now think remember, of yourself and then think of what you can handle. Twenty-four hours. Twenty-four hours straight. Twenty-four hours. Yeah. yeah. What could you penises handle? Penises would go inside your vagina in a twenty-four hour period. <laughs> Without judgment? Without judgment. No, without judgment. You're doing this for Guinness, okay? Yeah, you're trying Guinness to set a record. record. Not for beer. This is for Guinness, not for, not for social. And not for the beer. It's oh. for the actual Guinness oh, World Record. Oh, for the Guinness? That's yes. different. Nobody's yeah. going to judge you I mean, you that. can just dip a little dick in there if yeah. you want to. Yeah. Dip a little dick in there. All right. Like one stroke count? Uh, I yes, so. one pump. Yeah. I'm assuming that's what she did, because if this was full sex. Um, I would say 50. Or yeast. You could do 50? In 24 so. hours? I think I could do 50. Right. How many is that? It's like that means you know 24 hours. Almost two an hour? Yeah. Two an hour just seems doable. One, no, 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 but just like a one pump leave. Well, see, we didn't, get, we didn't give you all that information. We, we just told you like how many. No, I asked him. I was like, so is this like a, just a penis dick, like one time in? Such, I did ask Penis that. dick. I mean, <laughs> a penis vagina, like one Sherry, time in, that's in. it. Sherry Bourne says 150. Slim Picks at 100 plus. Okay. Shea Beautification says 40. Miss J, Miss Joyce said 40. Does this change your uh, answer at all? Uh, Brian P said, "Wasn't the, the record 300? If it was just like one in and out, yeah, I could do, you I could do like that. Two hundred like plus, two hundred plus. Yeah. Okay. What's, how much does the plus go to? I'm assuming not three hundred. Or you just said three hundred plus. I right? would say two two eighty. Two eighty. Okay. <laughs> so All right. specific. All right. Lose plus is eighty. <laughs> eighty people. There you go. <laughs> That's just a little plus. <laughs> Pat, right. you want the, you want you want the actual answer. Give the actual answer. This woman. Mm-hmm. Nine hundred and ninety. 990? So she had a little plus? 919. Nine, 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 no, it's not that much. 919. But what, what? The whole thing was a plus. <laughs> it was one super plus. But okay, was it like penis in, penis Probably. out? Probably. Was it like a line? And it, then said, oh, yeah, girl. it said you, sexual yeah. partners, so I'm assuming they did a, uh, like a technicality. Unless it was, I mean, smashing 900 people in a day, what is that math? Was she just Wait, like what? bent over the whole time and it was just like one? I think she probably uh, switched uh, positions because you knew that after a while you get tired of being on your back. Okay, side. We're doing mm-hmm. side for the next 10 she minutes. Had to, she, had, she had to take right. a little break for lunch, too. You had to who, who that's was 38 person? people a, oh, an hour. 38 an hour? That's, that's a that's, busy, see that where they busy dorm. That's my house. thing. No, but you know, no, because have, y'all have never, okay, I, mean, I don't really, I, don't, I never really watch porn like that, but I remember seeing, like, the cover. No, porn. listen, like, because, I like, going into Blockbuster or whatever, or Video Vault back in Kentucky, it was this room Video for the vault. porn, and so I remember, like, for seeing. For the porn. Did it have three X's? Was it lighted no, up? No, it was just like was a, a curtain. That was, yeah, it was just a curtain. But I remember looking the in curtain. there one day, and I saw like the cover of one of it, and it was like a gangbang. And I just saw dudes lined up, and this girl was like... Let me tell you something. I, I, like, it was that. Like that. I would not be able to stay <laughs> erect. erect for that long. You were way that, more niggas. Like, I mean, like, even if I'm in a line with 10 guys, I'm waiting there with 10 guys. I'm, I got to kind of like... 
just to like keep it up. Yeah, so at that, that point, turn, I'm not wasting time. Jerking to each other. Yeah, yeah jerking while y'all talking. Yeah, like, hey, hey, I'm coming around. Like, 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 it's like, what you're probably looking at. Wait, no, I would assume the, the line, game. like everybody was coming in there to. looking. Like it was, I don't think it was like one, two, nineteen people. No, no, I mean like, no, you move the line in. You know what I'm saying? They have a schedule. Just like you have a call sheet. They had a call sheet. Like, well, no, they had to have. They had to. If you late, you ruin the whole ratio. That's maybe well, that's the funniest part. Guys, it's ten guys in the room. You know, and one leaves. They had another. Other one, so it's always like 10 dudes, so you're not really waiting there with your dick hard for hours, it's mm-hmm. just when you're in the room. Well, I mean, the fight like to, to set a record, you need like record people like watching, yeah. Mm-hmm. So like there's probably official, a dude, an official person, like, yeah, looking mm-hmm. over their glasses. Just that's like, what I'm saying. I want to know the production of this. All. They did I want to know where they do it. Kim on stage studios, they yeah. no, they they not, <laughs> who's that guy not. that's like, all right, Jimmy not. James, <laughs> Jimmy James, is it? all right, cool. Begin. Mm-hmm. All right. I, I, I always think about like the scale or something Charles like on that. standby. <laughs> Charles on standby. Like, what, Go to your one. Go to your one. Go to your one. What's the smell? Smell like in a room oh, like God. that? Like besides, I would have the that smell so many, so many candles burning people? and incense that burning. Is a seafood boil. They don't, <laughs> they don't you know have, the, the people recording had the little clothespin. <laughs> Dirty bitch. <laughs> you know they were judging. You know they were judging because they, they weren't there for that. My daughter would never. <laughs> oh my god! I Charles tell you what, Guinness though. was in there. Like, <laughs> if any of those guys, Charles Guinness. <laughs> if any of one of those guys were wearing Hawthorne, then you can bet on the room smelling fantastic. Oh, okay, because Hawthorne is a premium men's grooming brand that makes it quick and easy to be confidently your best with skincare and hair care made just for. You. Now, Ooh. they use the data from hundreds of thousands of customers to recommend the perfect products for your body chemistry, your skin type, your hair type, and your lifestyle. I could lean on the stuff at the drugstore, but you don't know what you're getting. You don't know what's inside of those products. You don't know what it's going to smell like until you get it home. But with Hawthorne, you get a product that is made specifically for you. Okay, so lean on them. Upgrade your body wash, your shampoo, your deodorant. Let them recommend a face cleaner and a moisturizer that elevates your game. And of course, find yourself the perfect cologne. Now, I love Hawthorne because they give you two options, one for work, one for play when it comes to the cologne. Mm. And both of these are picked from a survey that you guys would do. And in the survey, they ask you questions like, what type of person are you? What do you like to go out? What do you like to hang out? What do you like to do when you go there? Like if you're a bar or club person, what do you drink? Are you a neat person? You're a mixed drink person? You're a beer person? All of those type of things, they take all of those questions and from that they create your profile and from those answers they also create you a unique scent. Now I know I'm a cologne connoisseur. I love to smell good as well. Ladies, is this, do you like to smell a man that that, that mm-hmm. has on great mm-hmm. cologne? And, oh, a good yes. smell could turn an ugly man fine. Absolutely. Hey, listen, you heard it here. Huh? A good smell can make, turn Cheat an ugly code. man fine, and it can boost your confidence, okay? Ooh. And it actually really works. Uh, at the end of the quiz, like I said, you'll, you'll, they'll view your, um, I'm sorry, you'll get a chance to view your customized, tailored products to your body, skin, hair, and lifestyle. Uh, the products I got were the shampoo, the body wash, the conditioner, and the cologne. Oh. I also got a cam- candle for them, so... Uh, oh, nice. I love the way I smell. I love the fact that I have a unique scent mm-hmm. that's made just for me. And every time I wear it, I always get a compliment. People always ask where they can get it. And I'll tell them, you can't. Mm-hmm. You can get one that's made just for you, but you can't get this one because it's made just for me. Mm-hmm. Hawthorne stands by their customers. So if you're not completely satisfied, they'll even retail your products for free based on your feedback. And you will pay nothing for the shipping. So there's truly no risk to step up your confidence and your smell good game. So make sure when you're ready. Uh, we should be right now that nothing holds you back. Go to Hawthorne and take the quiz today. All you have to do is go to Hawthorne.co. That's H-A-W-T-H-O-R-N-E dot C-O and use the promo code D-I-Y-S to get 10% off your first purchase. Again, that's Hawthorne.co. Use the promo code D-I-Y-S. Hawthorne.co. Promo code D-I-Y-S. Holla. Mm-hmm. That Come it on. works too. You know why? Because I can't smell your bacon smell at all. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, you I smell would, fantastic. You, you do. You don't <laughs> smell like you just came off the farm. Well, all right. <laughs> Well, that's because it that's, was that's customized for to here. It's farm away. They saw a little picture of Pat and they said he is in a little shopping cart. This is homeless be gone. Mine is just mine is just perfume. <laughs> Yours is just toilet water. This is a custom. They said him our, our version of white diamonds. <laughs> <laughs> hey, low key though, y'all have better smells than us. No, no, not I think so, man. The the. Did you smell me today? No. See, I don't smell. Do you have perfume on? Yeah. 
Oh, I don't smell it anymore. Damn you, Mark Did you Jacobs. laugh at all? I did. I did my tears. Laughter. Laugh it off. Yeah. I had a lot more on earlier. I hugged a, a couple women that I was like, I wouldn't mind smelling like this. <laughs> 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 so you guys know that's true. I used to do that with um, Polo Blue. Uh-huh. When it men? first came, yeah, it's men. Yeah, it smelled so, so Polo Blue did smell good. really, really good. I, used I, like, to I, do, I actually used to get that, and then I would put a little on, but I would mix it with my perfume. I just loved it. I yeah. just wanted people to <laughs> smell the same thing when they. So me. you're like the guy who like takes the the women's secret deodorant because you're like, oh my god, you got way too excited. Y'all have for that. way too you y'all you know, deodorant I, is so heard, much better. I, I actually know athletes, <laughs> professional athletes that use women's deodorant. They it's said it's so much better. First of all, I love the way Old Spice smell on men. Like it just smells so it smells so rustic and like and like. He got Jackie. a four hundred one k that he's yes. currently you his pension he yes. cashed in on. Yes. He I smelled. I, yeah. I wore Old Spice forever, and then they they started like burning. You know, like the, how they have the aluminum yeah. stuff yeah. that will burn you. I didn't know that. So yeah, I, I think it's the gel one. I never could use gel yeah, that deodorant. One, it, it, it always has like to be a, a stick for me. Yeah. yeah, the gel one would break my arm out. It was too Same. harsh. It was, yeah, it was, and they should have recalled it. I was waiting a little bit. I I no, get into no, it. No, I give it. Wait, wait, wait. We gotta give a little time before the ad. The girl version of it. I want smell. Okay, I use the girl version. Version of this, what oh, yeah, it? nah. Well, I Does mean, it, of this one, yeah. So, this is one of my favorites. This is actually a unisex one right here. What's well, a unisex? Yeah, well, this looks called, like a vape. It's, it's called uh, <laughs> this is not a blue bottle. Is That's it really? what it's called, yes. Where did you get this from? That's good, yeah. Where That's did you get that from? Good, actually. Um, oh my god, to him, I found it when I was uh subscribed to Scent Bird, and um, I, like that I was like, yeah, I like this, really but it's really mm. difficult to find. Like, I haven't found the store that, se- mm. that sells it, oh, yeah. so I have to order it online. This yeah. smell like when you go out to dinner, uh huh. This is your nighttime one, yeah. That's one of but them, but that one right there gonna make oh, some yeah. panties come oh, on, yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'll smell. When it comes to smell, <laughs> <laughs> let me spray my oh, t shirt real quick, take it home with me, right? Let me get the girl version of your Dolce Gabbana light blue, oh, intense, oh, yeah. Yeah, the yeah, intense makes a difference. It does. I it love is. when a man smells good with some good cologne. You'd be mm-hmm. like, ooh, this night gonna be different. Yeah, nothing but, but different. What if it was like a really good perfume, though? Uh, you going home. I'm dropping you off in the Uber. <laughs> After the hugs? Oh, yeah. no, 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 no. I'd be no, like, no. like, you smell like oh, me. No, 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 no. Right. Like, Why you you use... <laughs> Pat, did you ever use uh, X body spray? Yes, <laughs> man. I dark really times. good, though. I'm not gonna lie. Dark times. Dark times. I think it's the pheromones. Y'all don't know the real smell of Axe until you've been in a locker room filled with dude. Yeah. That oh. all use oh. different High flavors. Oh. oh my! And it's just it's just a mist of mm-hmm. must and and, and acts that don't really cover it Ew. up. Yeah, oh, acts is, it's, it's the thing that that cologne. To find a good cologne, you have to find one that has a good oil uh, base and a good oil amount in it because most colognes have more alcohol than oil and the mm-hmm. oil is what actually makes it stay longer if it's mm-hmm. more if it's higher in content than oil, uh, alcohol it's not going to last that long you know what you have to reapply so much the, the best cologne huh. I don't even know if it was a cologne or a perfume I have a feeling it was a cologne because I couldn't read it was in Arabic but when I went to Dubai I got oh, yeah. it that smelled big oil. They're big on oil, yeah. so their perfume and their cologne has a lot Fire. of oils in it. So it just lasts a lot too. longer. It smell it just What's the it, what's different about out there though? Do they like well, lean they just towards use more oils? That's, that's like that's, I feel like their, that's where that most of the their, oil come from. Ooh. Yeah. They, they're oil? just they've been doing no, that for cologne, hundreds but it's, and it's, hundreds it's of years. Higher oil co- like, that but that's all that. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's fire. That yeah. is fire. Yeah. Don't give nobody else that bottle. I don't they don't know where to find it. There's only a couple websites that I can find it on. I mean, so. the, the the name he gave us could have been fake, too. It could have been fake. It's <laughs> not a blue bottle. I would for sure do that. the bottle. I would do that. He <laughs> peeled it off. Right, 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 right. Have us somebody looking, Googling it right now. Hey, man. Have us looking dumb as hell in Macy's. Where's not a new blue bottle? <laughs> uh, 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 you definitely won't find it in Macy's. You definitely won't find it in Macy's. Not That's a blue bottle. Uh, as <laughs> soon as I get a man, I'm getting him that. You're not going to find this, though. You ain't going to find it, girl. Look, I'm going to find it. She got she got cryptic <laughs> skills of investigation. And I'm a reformed ninja, so I can break into somebody's <laughs> house real quick. For their scent? Oh, my That's God. That's the worst reason for a B&E. But we friends, so it's not really a B&E. <laughs> you don't even it's notice like, it's gone. It's just an like, E. Dude, why I'm not really my breaking in. Like, <laughs> you're in my house like, a little... <laughs> right. Turn the bathroom lights off. She's as hella clone. I'm big on the oils, though. Like, I do have... <laughs> 
The it Volvo makes oils sense. that I use with a couple colognes, like the Mercedes Benz cologne that I use. The, uh, Wait, the Mercedes black. Benz has. Yo. Wait a they minute. They make really? smells. Yo, they yo, smell. I'm, I'm telling you. New yo, car smell? Where did you get so that? red. If you smell this cologne with the oil combination that I put on, you're going to be like, nigga, teach me your ways. Where did you get this cologne? Mercedes from? Benz. It's very hard to find. Do they sell it at the dealership? <laughs> <laughs> He's just right. you get it in the stuff for the time. You, you, you get it free with the person of a G Wagon. So if you get a new G Wagon, they'll give you a couple bottles. That's called really? Armor All <laughs> to hear. No, no. They can sell you anything. You're like, man, if you buy the car, oh, come on, Tim. No, it does. I don't think anybody has this that. This is why I don't tell y'all nothing. <laughs> <laughs> this is why I don't tell y'all nothing. But for those that know, it's the black bottle. Okay? It's the black tall bottle. Uh, you okay, like, I got this new Mercedes stuff. It's called Benz WD Club Black. 40. <laughs> 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 I said a blue so, bottle. I'm slick as hell after that. <laughs> right. <laughs> I mean, this is called 04 DW. Oh, my God. We this know is why that. I don't tell y'all nothing. <laughs> If I got a rhythm, like, 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 you know you put a little Eddie Freeze in there. <laughs> Some designer makes it key. Are you talking about keyboard cleaner? That's it. Keyboard cleaner. <laughs> oh, that's the little portable ones? Yeah, this is, you got the little sample? I think this is... Did y'all ever use the that's magazines? The magazine samples and just rub the pages? Oh, yeah. I, I, still, that I still do that. I still be doing that. I, I still be doing that. It be falling out my little Ulta magazine. I'd be like, mm, that might be where I out. started wearing you know? women's scents. <laughs> I didn't know the difference. I was just like, oh, what is this? Oh, this smells good. You know what I used to do? I used to take those and open it up and put it like in my underwear drawer. Yeah. And put like, them in my, the drawer. Yeah, your clothes. Yeah. Just like oh, really? It works. Just the paper. Yeah. You just slip the page in yeah, there. Yeah, you open yep. it up and you just like like a little air freshener. I'm yeah. Huh. After that, I used to do it like I used to put it in my underwear. I'm put like, it in my drawers. She's just like. Oh, this is a summer. I've been putting this in my underwear for the last 10 years. She <laughs> got a yeast effect, a deadly yeast effect. It's summer citrus down there. I got that new pineapple Ciroc. <laughs> it just slide it in there. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. I, I definitely got a, I only got some, some YSL, and it smells super basic. But I love Mm-mm. YSL. The one I have is just like. YSL Y? It's the. They is got it the a whole square bunch bottle of them. and it has the actual Y on the no, bottom. No, no, no. It's it's square and it's like black, but it also has like another black wrap around it. Nah, you gotta you get, the, get the YSL uh, Y. It's 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 similar to the Dolce Gabbana light blue intense, but it's not as strong. Mm-hmm. It's a nice light scent, but people have to get a look closer to you to appreciate it. You sound like you work hmm. at Macy's. I just mm-hmm. love. Right. I'm very big on scent. Like I always have a candle anywhere I go. I always light a candle to set the vibe. The candle holds. Do you I'm take big. it when you travel? <laughs> All the time. I have three candles with me when I travel. My favorite right now is the volcano from Anthropology. It just smells. Mm. Do you put that in your check bag? I was about to say. Isn't no, I, I don't check it with me. I mean, I, I don't check carry it. On? I, I, yeah, it's carry on. I get the travel Why three? size ones. Uh, just because, like, different, different, rooms? different rooms, different vibes. So, like, in the green room, I use more of a calm citrus one like this. Oh, you bring it to work. Oh, that's, I take it to the green room. I take them everywhere. I'm very big on, like, creating a good energy and a I good I think it's like soy candles. Are you just yeah. burning? No, no, okay, no. Okay, I'm about to say, let me, you're over here messing my lungs up. That's soy candles. Candle and soy I have candle? electric, I have electric lighters. I, I've, I've been doing this for a while. What's a soy candle? It's like, because most. Candles are traditionally wax, like mm-hmm. regular, like beeswax, I guess. I don't know. But it's not uh-huh. like good for you to be inhaling that when it burns in the air. So then, you know, in the last few years, well, they started switching over invented? to like, that's how, with, with wax, that's what they've been using. But over the last, you know, few years, they've been switching over to soy, which so is like a better. So like all the other stuff, the, the, the stuff that's around the wick is all soy? Yeah, the, the wax that's in there? Yeah. yeah it's like made it's out of soy. soy. Wax. I don't know, you can do soy wax. Yeah. yeah. It's like better for the earth, better for the air, all that stuff. I feel like they burn better too. Like I feel like the they burn smell, slower, yeah, the, yeah, and it I like smells them. a little yeah, bit the stronger. Throw, the throw is usually a lot better with soy <laughs> candles. You want to go check see if it's soy? <laughs> Don't burn your dread. Don't, yeah, mm. yeah, Don't burn that. That dread is like kindling yeah. to a fire. Okay. Oh, that smells good. Yeah. We're now, uh, we're now taking the magnolia. Why now, here's the thing, though. A lot of people sleep on a. It's a lot of great places to get candles. This uh, uh, hearth in. Uh, 
Han is from Target. It is absolutely <laughs> amazing. Uh, you ain't got to show us because they ain't paying. Uh, okay. so yeah, they don't get the visual. <laughs> we are People taking just a candle and oh, sponsors now. But that brand with Magnolia, mm-hmm. I yeah. love Magnolia. Yeah. Chipper Joanna Gaines, mm-hmm. I love burn, you. Burn, 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 <laughs> I try to. I, I want to build some burn, stuff burn, with them. Burn, Let me tell y'all something. Burn. Another spot I get a lot of good candles from. Y'all ain't gonna even believe it. <clears throat> Nigga Ralphs. No, Ralphs, Ralphs have, but they're no, expensive. I do that. Go to yeah, Home Goods. Home that. Goods have the best candles for the low low. Yeah, where's Home you Goods? You could at? get. There's like just four Google over them. here. Yeah. Well, this one, the one, yeah. The ones, Google. The ones I go I to. Uh, Google locations. I mean, the one I get. Um, <laughs> I forget the name of it right now, but um, they're three wick candles, and mm. the smell will fill your house, mm-hmm. not just the room. I mean, the throw is amazing. Oh, those doing. giant ones. That yeah, yeah, but it's, it's like this big. But I have a. Uh, <clears throat> what is it? I'll use. Uh, Teak wood and something, and the other one is it's another city. A lot of good smelling wood. You know apparently. who got a good candle you might like? Uh, Alicia Keys got a candle. With her, she got a skincare line, and in the skincare line, she has a candle. That candle mm. is about that size. It filled up my whole bedroom. It was so amazing. Word. And it's so soothing and calming. It's I I, I light it before I go to bed. Yeah, I usually do the wood <laughs> wicks at home because I like the crackle. So yeah. I have that burning in the bathroom Ooh, when I'm taking a nice. bath. Ooh. Or in the office when I'm working, I have the the, uh, the wood wicks. Just because it's it's almost like playing a record. Like you hear yeah. the, the, the crackle on the record. It's just huh. a different vibe. I don't so. think I've ever noticed that in any of my wood wick candles. What, the, the crackle? crackle? They crackle. Yeah, they that's, crackle. That's what I put on my, 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 my white noise at night. I put on my Babylon Brook and a crackle of frame, the, the flame crackling. Mm-hmm. So you can hear the on YouTube? Crack- no, on my Alexa. Oh. So I could play that at night when I go to sleep and you just hear the crackling mm-hmm. of the flame and the water. I do yeah. thunderstorm, fireplace, crackle at the same time. Yeah. I do vacuum cleaner. What do you use? Rain, what? rain app? <laughs> I, it was because the you baby. A dog? <laughs> I did it because the baby. Vacuum cleaner, like there's a white noise app. And so when mm-hmm. it's a baby, we just always use the, the Wait. vacuum cleaner one. Wait, and so minute. now, and it sounds like, you know when you're on That's an airplane ASMR? and it just mm-hmm. sounds I like. I hate that. I hate that. But so like, I don't that? even notice. Yeah. It's, it's more white noise than. Yeah, it's white noise. What do you, what do you YouTube? No, no, it's it was an app. It's actually a white noise app. But if you just put like white Vac- noise uh, vacuum cleaner, vacuum sounds for sleeping actually popped up. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. It's it va- like? vacuum because it's very like babies need like that. Oh my god! Oh, that's oh, that was pissed me off. Yeah. I'm telling you, baby. It's like sleeping at, at your corporate job. Yeah, waking up in somebody's the in the cubicle like, hey, <laughs> buddy. But go to, uh, go to airplane white noise sound. It sounds, it sounds the same. It's just a little lower than It's just on a different frequency. Mm-hmm. Than that, but they they sound very, very but I, similar. But I think the reason why is because like when babies are in the womb, really it's very it, it's very noisy like that in the womb. You mm. hear blood rushing back and in and out. Then you hear the heartbeat. Boom. It's just very loud. Listen so out. they're used to. So they're used to noise, not yeah, like yeah. It's mm. no, it's not from quiet. in the womb. Absolutely, it's so loud in there. I mean, it makes oh, sense. Also, playing too. music for them actually works. Yeah, they, actually yeah, hear they it. love no, and they and that kind of noise like that is like soothing to them because that that's it's just. Whoosh, 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 it's well, probably like sense. crazy on the inside of your body what it sounds like. So why everybody be like, be quiet, the baby's sleeping. Oh, because they don't want you to wake them up. That yeah, once they sleep, sleep. Yeah, that helps them fall asleep. Yeah. But like, yeah, once they're asleep. I don't know. I've actually never flown in first class. Now what? that I think about it. As rich as you are. But um, I know, that's, you that's got, the stupidest you be, reason to spend money, though. You got, it is, no, it's amazing. No, it's not. No, it's, it's not. It is, it is the best experience ever. And then the best part is when you be judging everybody else who mm, walk in after you be like, ha ha. It's all, it seems like it's all about that. <laughs> it's not, though. It's not. Like, it's comfort. If you, if you fly as much as we do, yeah. you, want it's, that. you want the leg room. You don't ever want, like, I, I can pull up the email I just sent our travel agent because he had me booked for a middle seat. And he's been messing up a little bit. No, he's been messing up a lot. And we <laughs> let a lot seat go. Is trash. He said, I got the, my, this, trash this past enough. trip. He had me on an owl seat going there, which I never request. And then he had me on a middle seat on the way back. In I first class? him a skate. No, just, just comfort plus. But still, okay. scathing email. You will not <clears throat> ever do me like this. I will always have a window seat. Was this before or after the trip? This, oh, he fixed it before the trip happened. Oh, okay, good. He fixed it before I caught on the plane. I was like, no. Nah, Wait, you do, do window seats now? I thought you like. This is really mad. I, I, like, I like scathing. windows so I can fall <laughs> yeah, asleep. That's, that's only sleep is very, when you fish. very important for me, especially like if you have a. If you, you're going into the trip, you want to go into it like as peaceful and as yeah. calm as possible. Mm-hmm. And it's the same thing after you're leaving because you might have had a horrible show or whatever. So mm-hmm. I'm all. I'm super big on sleep, bro. Like, yeah. I, once I realized that's that I had sleep yeah. apnea and I went and did that sleep study and I got the CPAP and all that, well, I realized how many years I had not mm. been getting quality sleep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And you need quality sleep because your brain creates toxins every day. Mm-hmm. And when you get to the REM level, that's the only way those toxins are released. 
So without that, you can like have only onset. I mean, only onset Alzheimer's. You could have um, multiple memory loss, all type of things that affect your brain, just because you're not getting rid of that brain fog every day. No <laughs> toxins that are created. So I take sleep very seriously. I take yeah. comfort very seri seriously, which is why I only sleep on the purple mattress because the purple mattress has this unique mm -hmm. grid. Mm -hmm ventilated design that allows air to flow through to help you sleep cool. I always run hot. I'm hot right now. And we asked them to turn the air on already and I'm still hot because I run hot. Even when it's like a thousand degrees outside, the purple mattress is cool. Um, the grid is amazingly supportive to your back and your legs while cushioning your shoulders, neck, and hips no matter how you sleep. I'm a side sleeper. I cannot sleep on my back for the life of me. Uh, it just doesn't work. So to have that support, even when I'm sleeping on my side, is amazing. And you get to try your Purple Mattress risk-free with free shipping and returns. Financing is available. Listen, there's no reason not to check out the Purple Mattress. We started first with the uh, the seat cushion, and then uh, they sent me out a pillow to try out. Love the pillow so much that Farron stole it. I do not own my <laughs> pillow anymore. And I was like, yo, man, this really is different from sleeping on traditional pillows and sitting on traditional uh, cushions. I want to see what the mattress was like. We got the mattress, and it was one of the best purchases that we ever did. So shout out to Purple Mattress. If you guys are ready to take action right now, Purple is comfort reinvented. Right now, if you can get 10% off any order of $200 or more, go to purple.com slash DIYS10 and use the promo code DIYS10. That's purple.com slash DIYS10, promo code DIYS10 for 10% off of any order of $200 or more, purple.com slash DIYS10, promo code DIYS10. Terms apply. I want a purple mattress. Get it. Oh, man. It's going to change your yes. life, Lou. Fam. They, make it, they so got king much size? Better. Um, I'm pretty they sure all sizes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But get a pillow. If, you, if you're on the fence, get the fill, pillow first, and then you'll get the rest. Ooh, you Ooh the okay. I got Let me try that. Mm. It's a little, you know, it's fire. It changed your life? It did. Changed wow. my neck. Ooh, I want that. Uh, <laughs> so the reason I, I brought up first class is because when I, when I searched for airplane white noise, they specified that some of the videos are in first class. Man, I mm -hmm. love first class. Is it is it less noisy it's, up there? It's, 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 I think it is because you're away, you're from, away from the engine. The engine. Yeah, you're yeah. further away from the uh, engine. I thought they were being bougie. No. Nah. Nah. <laughs> and it's like, I think it's Delta. No, it's a Delta that has the one that the, the first class that it lays down into a bed. Yeah, oh, that yeah, one does it. They have it and also United has it as well. Yeah. That's and, a good deal. Yeah. This is nice. Oh, that could do that. The 777 it's has like it too. In the front, they have like, you can fully lay down um, it's a spot for your feet. You kind of yep. like cat a corner mm -hmm. like that. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's I like dope. That. Like, let, bro, I'm telling you, like, I've definitely splurged on some flights this year. Yeah. yeah. Like just bumping up to, especially like on a long flight. From has to be a long flight to yeah. New York. I want to do first yeah. class to like San Francisco. Anything yeah. under two hours on, I really don't care. As long as I got a window <coughs> seat and I'm in comfort, I'm good. Yeah. I got more leg room and all of that. Mm -hmm. But if it's three and a half or more. I'm going yeah. to see how much it costs. Now, some of them yeah. will be ridiculous. Some of them are like $1,000 to, to upgrade. I'm like, I'm not spending that. It's but not. if it's like five, yeah. If it's like I'm, five, I'm, I'm taking it. I'll pull the trigger. I didn't know they were that much. I thought it was oh, thousands. Oh, man, they are. They are. No, it depends always. on where you're going. Yeah, it depends on where you're depends going. But, I, but honestly, I wouldn't do it unless you're, like, traveling for, like, a few hours. Like, like yeah. you said, three or plus hours. Because it's not worth, outside of that, you pay a lot of money and you're only on the plane for, like, an hour and a half. Like, right. Yeah. So, coast to coast, you guys would do it? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. And actually, if I don't plan on sleeping, if I plan on sleeping, I mean, it's great for comfort, but I also like to like experience what I'm paying for. So, like, I like to just lay back and watch movies. Because in first yeah. class, you always get fed. Always get yeah. and you get alcohol, whatever you deserve, yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah. 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 This, you get free, free. comfort too on Delta, but you don't but get the desserts and the. You food. don't get the dessert and the food. Desserts? But they yeah. got desserts. Yeah, they got desserts. Yeah. They be like, "Would you like ice cream? Would you like we have?" What? Right. Really? You know what? When I was when I when I when I'm saying. I first had Mav. He was three months old. We took a for, for <clears> Christmas. My fiance bought us like first class flight. So all of us, like me, him, and the baby, first class. It was great. To and where? Then, um, to can, <clears throat> wait Miami from L.A. to Miami. Okay. And then on the way back, I had to go with the baby by myself. And so I was on first class going back, mm -hmm. and it was like it was such a relief because mm -hmm. with a baby, there's like so much more room. They was feeding me, so I was like, I'm eating, I'm holding my baby. I was like, this is great. Did he need Man. another chair, or he no, got to have it? When, you, when they're under um, two, like you can. Is it one under two? Then you can like sit. They can sit in your lap. Man, I oh, no. I, I did a a, a, a shoot class. in in New York, and they flew me first class. When I mm. say I got there. 
when I checked in, when as soon as I sat down, it was like, would you like something to drink? Would you like a mimosa? I was like, yes, mm-hmm. I would like a mimosa. And right. Like sweaty people trying and to get was to like, And I was like, you're, you're, <laughs> mimosa. Drink, you're, 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 you're dripping on my mimosas. Like, right, right. And then they was you like, would you like best. breakfast? I was like, what's for breakfast? <laughs> we have blueberry pancakes. Um, it'd, be, it'd be like for real. Right they had, no, no, no. They had the little tray. They had the little tray. They had the little tray. I was like, we had blueberry pancakes, and I had like um, uh, eggs and and uh, full breakfast. Like, and it was only limited. It's only for first class. So they'd be like, Dang. what do you want? And then it was like, okay. And it was like, what would you like for dessert? We had this kind of cake or a pie or ice cream. I was like, what should you bring it all? Like, man, when listen. you're dropping bread, they will, they will. Right. Serve you, I mean, you, you got I feel a whole like every 20 minutes they came with something different. I appreciate that because you should feel like you experience that difference because they're going to definitely charge you for it. Right. right. That's why I love, like, I don't like American's app. I don't like United's app. I love Delta's app. Fact. You get to, up. you can upgrade hmm. from the app. You get to see when your bags are loaded. They'll tell yeah, you yeah. when, what, what bag is claimed. You can pick them up from. They, you're going to know what terminal yeah. you're going to land in. Damn. All of that stuff. I like to know that type of stuff. I have a, man, I have such a routine when I get on the plane. I have two carry-on bags, usually like my, my crossbody and then my, my shoe case. Mm-hmm. Put the shoe case up top, take my iPad out, I sit back, I watch. If I don't feel like watching a movie, I throw on my playlist. I have so many playlists on Amazon Music right now. It is ridiculous. Amazon Music has more than 10 million free podcast episodes to listen to. But Amazon Music isn't just for people who listen to podcasts. They have 75 million, actually over 75 million songs Dang. also available. You understand what I'm saying really? to you? Yes. And it's it's crazy. A lot of people have been sleeping on this, but I'm telling you, man, I'm going to get a deal with Amazon. I'm going to let them know, hey, man, I'll curate some of these playlists for you because yeah. I think I do an amazing job with the playlist, all right? And with Amazon Music Unlimited, you can listen to any song anywhere offline, Unlimited skips. It does not what? matter. Okay, uh, y'all know. I, I for during the quarantine, I made fourteen installments of Quarantine and Chill playlist. <laughs> nice. And these are just songs that really resonated with me. That just put you in the mindset of being at home, being chilling with your person. It doesn't matter. Um, I love listening to music without hitting ads in between, which is why I signed up for the Amazon Music Unlimited. And if you guys are on the same vibe with me, which I know a lot of you guys are, I encourage you to try Amazon Music Unlimited right now. For free for 30, di- 30 days. You understand me? No credit card needed. Right? Mm-hmm. It's not required. You know, a lot of people want you to sign up for something and want you to put your credit card in so you forget on the 30 days and they automatically mm-hmm. join you. Yeah, no credit Sham. card required. All right, just yeah. go to Amazon.com slash DIYS. That's Amazon.com slash DIYS to try Amazon Music Unlimited free for 30 days. Amazon.com slash DIYS. Renews automatically. Cancel anytime. Turns apply, but you don't have to put the credit card down. Holla at them. Tell them your boy sent you. you I'm gonna try that. Yeah. I actually like Amazon Music the best. Yeah. My favorite. I, I like I like how easy it is. Like mm-hmm. you can they have the um they have the lyrics up so you can read along and because mm-hmm. like, I'm big on like right. learning. Especially learning like new you, words. you hear verse, you be like, oh I need to <laughs> learn that. But also you can like literally just swipe and you can watch the video for the song oh, too. Yeah. So you don't have like just search uh, it. It's, it's all in also one? like oh, right I like there. That. So I, it's super hey, dope. It's super been doing that. That's yeah, dope. super streamlined, super clean. Uh, platform definitely check them out, man. <laughs> I rock with them, so. Well, I'm gonna do that. Amazon. That is you should do that. as litty you know as a titty would be. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Um, I do want to, I want to talk to somebody about this because this is just. I want to talk to Samson. This. <laughs> I want to talk to Samson. <laughs> Find me to the moon like my <laughs> like that bitch out of friend. I still don't know who that is. back and drifted. Um, so okay. I don't even know how to bring this in. It's just, just, it's, just bo- it. it's just bothering me, okay? So there's a, there's a, there's a boy, a teenager, who uh, had to undergo emergency penis surgery oh, wow. uh, because he somehow managed to insert a USB cord hmm. into his urethra. How did he do that? That is so... Oh and uh, that's not even the worst part. He had inserted the cable into his urethra to measure the length of his penis... Uh, triggered by sexual curiosity, rulers. Ruler, why would you a ruler? The good old, the good old fashioned high school a ruler remote? base. A we remote took it all the way to the base. We talked about do that on not, the episode of Squadcast today. Do they not use rulers today. anymore? Oh, really? in school? Yeah, measuring. Yeah, because you were talking about like remember the the scientists see like they go along oh, and along yeah, every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like high yeah, school, yeah, all three, the guys three had it on their inches. base. Yeah, that's three inches is a it's normal, right? I guess like our kids not using rulers anymore. Why would you remotes? Because isn't there a there's a there's an app on iPhones that says Measure it, measures yeah, everything. You can yeah, use that. you can yeah. it. So he was trying to digitally do it by USB. 
That is true, though. Now, There's no it, real was reason. Was the USB cable with the connector still attached? I mean, yes. probably. Yes, How because that... here's what's messed up. Oh, God. This backfired when the cable became lodged in the scrotum. Huh? He went that Wait, so far he went with all it. In. He, went, he went all the way into the emergency bag. And couldn't pull it back out. And he tried to take it out. Oh! But it became so tangled oh, shit. that by the time he was done, both ends of the cord were hanging out of his penis. How does that even happen? So he got the one end out, so it looped back. It through. looped. Oh, you, oh if, you see the ex, if you see the x-ray. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it, oh, the x-ray looks like a jumbled up charger in your drawer. Yeah. Who's no. tangling that? Look how long this cord is. I thought you were talking about. But like, it goes through. A bunch of different ways. I like, thought it was like, you know, like the actual cord that you get with like an iPhone. It's not that long. It's like three feet, right? No, that's the Amazon cord that you this order. This is the one that's with like the a rope. 10 feet. Yeah, that's, that's the one. That's, 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 that's the rope. That's a long ass cord. And that's the one. He's, a, he's <laughs> lying. Yeah, the that little boy is lying. The cord is pink. How the cord is pink. No, I'm saying he, t- he lied and, and said thing. that he was curious and wanted to measure his penis. There's no way. No, that's There's not sexual. Way. That's what he told his parents. Exactly. He was like, he wanted to do something nasty. He was like, ooh, I'm gonna try this. Even if, yeah, even if it was measuring, it'd be like, okay, the end of this is measuring. Yeah, like, he like, ow, 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 ow. Oh, I'm so insane. How do you go tell that to your mom or your dad? Like, you don't have to. You just like, they're trying to get into the bathroom after a while. Anybody need to charge their phone? Put your phone down there. It's like, you hear the little sounds? Crazy. What kind of surgery needs to happen then? They got to go inside the scrotum. You got to cut the dick off. You got to, like a hot dog. You got to cut it down the middle. Oh, baby. And then take it out. Like in the microwave. And then sew it back up in the middle. No, they probably would take those the... Those were delicious, though. I didn't mind that. <laughs> 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 when, when it blew up in the microwave, it was like, oh, this is even easier. Yeah, it's like the mustard and the ketchup in the middle. A little sauce track. Yeah, that's right. 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 Your yeah, so when I had to get, when, yeah, when I had to get the uh, cystoscopy, um, they 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 take a syringe and they s- squirt this numbing gel inside of you first, which is weird because it feels like you're peeing backwards. <gasps> oh, right? weird. So well, they, what, what is... they 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 squirt that in you first and um, give it a couple minutes and then. Uh, um, and then yeah. they put the little camera. Yeah, in. they put the camera in. Now the camera. Are you awake while this is happening? Yes. Yeah. It's an outpatient surgery. No. And so there's a screen <laughs> right here, so I can see everything that the doctor sees with the camera. Now the camera uh, is like the width of. It's really tiny. Yeah. It's really well, skinny. well, no, I mean the the cord. It's like this. So there's a camera on the end of this, but this is the width of the cord. Now around the camera that? is yes. Does your does your penis like like how women's vaginas like it opens? Yeah, yeah you but ain't it's never also went numb. like this to a penis and saw it, the little the little urethra. Yeah, yeah. but it, how big does it get? Like so can I open it up? I feel like it can, yeah. There's I water coming tongue, out but... too. So the water coming out pushes. Where's the water from? The water is inside of the cable too. So like there's an AV cord, I guess. Oh, so that's like probably the dentist thing. Yeah, so it's lubricated, oh. but it also pushes it forward. So like, if there's any blockage, it's like the water you know, helps propel it. Yes. How far did it go down? It he when they did it for me, he had to. He was looking at my uh, kidneys. Um, Wait, so, they can go any other way. I mean, yeah, yeah, my bladder, my bladder. Yeah, they, they, well, they, 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 they went through the dick. It's an asshole. Yeah, the, yeah. Uh, can you go through the kidney for the asshole? <laughs> no, that's a longer route. Because like when you're passing <laughs> the kidney, yeah, down, the ass. Yeah, yeah. Down, yeah. Down, yeah. that's oh, a longer that route. I don't yeah. know. Yeah, it was something around. It was very uncomfortable. You were you you were looking at it. I was. It was weird because I I talked about it on stage. The water once it hits inside of like your stomach, you feel like you have to pee. And so uh, I was like, yep, I got to pee. I got to pee. He was like, hey, don't worry about it. It did go away. I'm like, no, it's not going away. He was like, all right, well, you can go ahead and release. I was like, oh, you? No. I Was the cord never. still in? Yes. He was just like, oh, did you pee? pee? No, I held it. So you were holding it? I, you no. didn't want to give him and a golden shower? I did not. And you feel the water filling up. I would have peed on that you nigga for feel- doing oh. it. I would have, too. Have you ever got a, um, for just a, doing that. a colonic? Just I feel like that's like a colonic. <laughs> I feel this doctor. It was, I haven't got a colonic, but I want to get one. I, I feel get it like it's, I, I told you we should get a colonic on camera. What I is that? Where they, where you, it basically, well, the new ones, um, they basically like 
put this tube in your butt. It pu- pushes water in, and basically yeah. that causes your bowels to like contract and pushes everything. Out, so it, it pushes to clean up, it. like up into your butthole, mm-hmm. or just on it. And then, uh, all the shit from years, it's just a, years. It's just a little. Yeah, yeah. So yeah something it's just you ate from like, like all the stuff that's on the like a candy that you ate from when you was twelve because it's stuck up there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if that ain't dissolved by now, then it's McDonald's. What if it was all candy, just like a pinata? It's all candy in a wrap. You no. got no digested candy. It's just all straight candy. Kit Kat. Skittles still uh, the same. All and the McDonald's size. fries. Like, what? <laughs> but I will tell you, it, it will make you feel like, oh, like, because like, I remember when I first got it done, the la- the technician came back in there. She was like, okay, I just want to make sure. She First she was like, you know, told me how to do it myself. And then I was like, I, I can't. I don't I don't know if I did it right. I just weird. And so she was like, okay, well, let me help. Like, so I was like, wait, you're going to you're gonna do it? She was like, no, no, you can do it. I'll just like guide you because you literally just put, basically, this is your butt hole you put it in like this mm. much it's not nah I want somebody to do it for me uh, I'm not, but, it, but it's not, it's not nope. you're not really sticking in nope. it's I don't literally do it. nope. right here nope and then it we it's I don't know how it does it but it pushes the water in and I guess she was like the poop kind of goes around it. I was like isn't it gonna put poop back in this she was like no because it's constantly pushing water in and so then you got that you just have horrible. poop coming out and then when it starts to get further up in your bowels then it starts to because before it just looks kind of watery that sounds fun but like as it goes <laughs> up your mouth it starts to get like different color like that darker that sounds so and interesting and fun I want to do it darker Listen, your poop like they are because in the it comments goes through going like, crazy they're like alright next topic <laughs> nope really we can move on <laughs> oh wait before we do I'm going to give you guys Forgot one more nice. horrible thing <laughs> this is this. I, I, I just read how he got the cord out oh my god tell me ah uh. The surgeons had to make an incision. I told oh you. my god! In the region between the genital and the anus, they cut uh, the gooch. Cut his the tank. Wow. The tank. Gooch cut his little or taint. You know the little taint. The taint. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So they just I call it gooch. Pull it all the way through that way? Well, they said that they 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 went in through the gooch, right? They said that they pulled the they they spooled an end through the hole first, and then they had to cut it free from the rest of the wire before they can take the rest of it out. So, oh, it wait, tangled. so they had to put it back up like, through him? Just... Because you said both ends was coming out. So if they did it, they had to pull it back through. I'm assuming they probably cut off the ends, because you said both ends And they just coming pulled it out, out from the front. Is like... that what they mean? <laughs> Let me tell you. That must be it. I saw uh, some of the other things I want to... He's a teenager. Teenager, yeah, didn't say exactly. Hey, Cam, what you eating 15 years old. 15. Uh, my HelloFresh meals are on the way, so we'll see what's in the box. Oh, <laughs> it's funny that nice. you mention that because I should receive my shipment as well today. <laughs> well, okay, HelloFresh. Let me tell you about HelloFresh, Lulu. <laughs> I me. don't like going to the grocery store. Neither do I. I don't like parking. I don't like grabbing my reusable bags. I don't like any of that. Okay. Mm-hmm. I don't like going in the aisles and have them shuffle past people and all mm-hmm. of that. And if you want to get one thing of alcohol, now you got You can't even do the self checkout. All it is, it's too much. <laughs> too much. Okay, that's why I go with Hello Fresh. Okay, with Hello Fresh, you get fresh, pre measured ingredients and mouth watering seasonal recipes delivered Ooh. right to your front door. You get to skip trips to the grocery store and count on Hello Fresh to make home co- cooking easy, fun, and affordable. That's why they're America's <laughs> number one meal kit, man. Just in case you didn't know. So. Because it's fall, uh, a lot of us, are, our schedules are picking up with filming and things like that. It's already busy. But HelloFresh recipes save you time that you'd otherwise spend meal planning, shopping, shopping, all of that. So now you can get back to what really matters, kicking your feet up, spending time with your family, submitting invoices, getting paid. You understand yeah. me? Paid. HelloFresh offers 50 menu and market items to choose from every Week from veget- right? yes, from vegetarian meals and calorie smart meals and choices to extra special gourmet options. There's something for everyone to enjoy with recipes designed and tested by professional chefs and nutritional experts to ensure deliciousness and simplicity. That's what I like. Now, when I did the HelloFresh initially, I uh, did a couple uh, burger things, and then I got deeper into it. I was zesting lemon, mm-hmm. okay? I'm talking mm-hmm. about I had the grater on that, zesting it over the pasta. I was sautéing stuff. Now, in, the, in, in reality, these things only take like 10, 15 minutes to make, mm-hmm. but it looks and tastes like it took hours to prepare, which is another thing I love. I get to flex on the humble and still be simple, but it tastes delicious. So... You guys need to check out HelloFresh right now. I'm telling you guys, I'm going to hook you up. Go to HelloFresh.com slash D-I-Y-S-14. That's 1-4. And use the code D-I-Y-S-14, and you will get up to 14 free meals, including what? free shipping. It's too oh, yes. Including free shipping, Lou. That's the cherry on top, okay? Oh, yeah. You going to give me I free get, food and uh, free shipping? Yes, Lou. <laughs> 
Now holla at your baby. Go to HelloFresh.com slash DIYS14. Use the promo code DIYS14 to get up to 14 free meals, including mm. free shipping. All right? You guys do this right now and find out why HelloFresh is America's number one mm. meal kit. I'm like doing it. it. I just switched to HelloFresh. Um... Yeah, they're 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 the competitors that be sending you frozen foods. Are Cause not I've tried it. them all. I've <laughs> not had, it. and I'm tired. Yeah, <laughs> and I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't mind cooking, HelloFresh is pretty good. I don't yeah, mind it's cooking. So much as long as I yeah. have it, somebody telling me what to cook. No, oh, it's yeah. super the, easy the too. It's like six super, steps. Yeah. 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 Oh, I need. But that. it's still like gourmet stuff, like shrimp tacos and all this stuff Ooh, that really you wouldn't good. make on your own. Maybe we have like Korean bulgogi stuff. I'm tired of eating the same thing. That's, Bro, why, that's, why, that's why I got on yes. because I'm a type of person who would just make the same thing all the time. Awesome. I hate if shopping. it's easy, I yeah. Hate shopping, so mm-hmm. like, I hate Hello trying to figure out meals. That's what it is. Yeah. It's that's like, the thing. They, with yeah. the 50 options that they give you, you can pick what you want to eat. Mm-hmm. You can pick what day it comes on. Um, and that way you you won't try the same thing. And because like it's like already it pre measured and it's already pre packaged, you don't have to go to the store and like, all right, I need this for this recipe, this for that. Everything comes together. Fantastic the recipes idea, come yeah. in the box. It, it like it's it doesn't get any. What if you want to diet? They, they have, have calorie, they have calorie yeah. smart play, uh, uh, options as well. And they got mm-hmm. snacks and all. Yo, you can do everything with them. Because I need to lose some weight. Me too. No, you don't. You look good, girl. Thank you, girl. You do look too. fantastic, Lou. Thank, thank you, y'all. Love You're welcome. Girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, how you doing? <laughs> Speaking of upgraded stuff. <laughs> Great transition, <laughs> Speaking of, I just do speaking of. Speaking, speaking of. of what I'm about to say next, <laughs> um, there's a rumor that Target is about to start opening a full bar Shut so up. you can drink while you shop. That is the best thing that they have That's ever as said. Yeah. As if Target they, wasn't already enough they of a need trap. They to step their security up before they do anything like oh, that. Oh, because there's going to be some niggas coming in uh, like, just drugs. to drink. Just they coming in just to drink. Holler at the bartender and all of that. Nah. Well, that'd be cool. Holler at chicks coming in like, I'm just trying I'm to sure get some wipes. That. Like, why are you up in my face? It's Listen. gonna be the new club spot. Like, you trying to go to Target yeah. tonight? Yeah. <laughs> I'd be down. I you love Target. You already go to Target buying one thing, come out spending one hundred and fifty dollars. Now it's four hundred. Go in drinking. Yo. I don't know how they gonna get around like, drinking and driving. Drinking and driving, right? Those type of like. Oh, it's gonna be mess. <laughs> Same as bars. I mean, how do they get around it? Oh, you have to, you have yeah. to I mean, but there's always, I feel <laughs> like there's just an increase, like, you know, ability for people to sue them because they could be like, ah, oh, I got in this accident after I left you, Target, drinking your stupid wine. They might have Target a cutoff, though. I don't think they're having people get wasted in there, especially if it's for like a shopping. Yeah. It might be like a little wine a or something. Yeah. yeah, like a two, three drink minimum. There's gonna be so many Target parking lot fights. Wine and beer and like hard liquor. Yeah, I don't think it's it's definitely gonna be. Well, it says full bar. I think it's amazing because the headline. This is. <laughs> That's wild. Probably not. They're Shopping probably... cart shots. They have like drink holders. I feel like Target's feel like Target always filled with like moms and kids. So now you're gonna see a bunch of drunk moms like pushing their. They're kid down drunk the in there drunk already. They, got they were already <laughs> drunk in there. That'd be worse. I don't, think, I don't think it's a good idea, especially with like the like, escalator situation with the cart. You're gonna have people trying to go down the cart escalator. Oh no! Uh, uh, well, they already say no people, just carts. It don't matter. You think <laughs> drunk people gonna read that? You think drunk people like? Oh, I'm not supposed to go down. There. No! There's, there's also targets everywhere. Somebody's going to be like, I bet I could. <laughs> <laughs> you think somebody can toy out with super soakers? Like, cool. Ah! Oh there was God. another shooting in the front I of Target. I bet I could. <laughs> <laughs> I think Pretty it's great tracking. because there's a lot of people, like couples who go and they do, like, I don't really want to walk around with you. Like, all right, set up the bra. Set up the yeah, bra. That's, that's another actually... thing to drop the drop the dad or whatever. Then can get money there and wear your shoes. Exactly. Yes. Exactly. I, I mean, is Starbucks not enough? No. 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 Starbucks be closing early. It ain't turned early. up. And they don't be having Starbucks everything. Be Starbucks, Starbucks hella hella be at, be always be open. They be closing hella early. They don't be having man. everything. They, but we don't got that. We don't got that. Also, Starbucks no during the shopping doesn't improve it. It does for me. I always just stop there and get you my latte and get my chai latte and then I go walk around with it. But the, I mean, shop. have you ever shopped in like the bedding in the lamp section? It's just, ugh. Yeah, it's, it's just boring. boring. <laughs> <laughs> Turn me up. Turn me up. You I'm have gonna, comforters. I, I mean, you're going to have to, you're gonna have to <laughs> stay at the bar area with the drinks. Can you imagine people walking through Target with a glass of wine, spilling it on products, like just ruining uh, it? So you can drink while you shop, though. Yeah, drink and uh. then go shop. Oh, yeah, they don't want it. They don't want it. You be, in, you be looking at that towel like, like wow. This <laughs> 50 person finds you just wine everywhere. Like, Somebody <laughs> accidentally hits you and your I'm kid drunk. runs into your, your <laughs> ankle you with the back of the cart <laughs> and you spill the wine <laughs> on the <laughs> new thing yeah, and throw pillows? Nah. I don't think it's a good idea. It sounds horrible. I think it's a great idea. Things going to be in gardening, having full fights, sword fights. I'm gone. No, they're going to be in gardening, like making an actual garden in the aisle. Like, this is easy. soil. 
<laughs> people <laughs> open it up like, you see, I told you it tastes like this. <laughs> Sir, you have to do that in your garden at home. <laughs> right. I'm testing. He's got you. Got you. Soil all over me. <laughs> First of all, what kind of drunk are you getting? <laughs> I don't know, this is wild scenario. Yeah, like in the home and garden, like, mm, soil? Yeah, right. <laughs> I didn't do anything. I've never done anything that I said I would do in Target. It's just, it's just the atmosphere. It makes you want to go above and beyond. Oh, for sure. Yeah, Shots yeah. in Target is a new experience. There's going to be all types of I IG stories. Cool. You drunk, you ain't going to worry about that price that much when <laughs> right. you get to the register. Just yeah. when you wake up the next morning, you be like, I spent $500 at Target. You check your story, it's like a whole party. There's <laughs> girls with sparklers. <laughs> Shit, I don't remember <laughs> I yeah, and they have bottle girls at Target. That'd be amazing. They got like Target shirts. And oh like, my god! Like, you just pick it out electronic. <laughs> I just hope they don't do it to every Target. No, I want them goes. to do that no. at the Target no, on the other end of my, my, my neighborhood. Don't do that at my neighborhood Target. No. Do that at the other one. I just, right? I just want to get a tampons and the bitch be like, "Who got the Ciroc?" This could be a nigga selling roses in the front of the Target. <laughs> I'm not even with anybody. <laughs> Would you like rose? Maybe yeah. that's why you need rose. <laughs> uh, target titties. You're going to say Target titties. titties. You're going to be parking lot pipping. I don't want that at all. I don't. I do. That's that sounds fun. lit. That I'm seems going to Target. No, I would, because I'm too much, I'm too like clumsy, like just the, I didn't even need that bar because the other day I literally fell in front of Target, like fell Sober. so hard. <laughs> I scraped my foot up, and this lady was like, oh, no! Like, she screamed for me. It was such a bad fall. And, like, my phone, like, went sliding on the <laughs> asphalt. Jesus, man, what did this you is, trip off This for? is why there's a bar now. They, they saw that, and they were like, we might as well. They were like, we, we might as well serve <laughs> drinks. <laughs> they were like, do we have a bar? We might as well. Everyone's drunk here anyway. Wow. <laughs> so hard. It was just bad. Goodness, <laughs> I'm so down for Target titties. Hey, they'd probably <laughs> overcharge for the drinks, which is hilarious. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Oh. To be like, oh, the same bottles, you're selling it. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> nah, yeah. Grey Goose, 400. But that one you got to buy first before you can open it. Or you can get this one right now. Wait, what, <laughs> like, what time would the bar open? Because Target's open for 6 like, a.m. 6 a.m. 6 a.m.? <laughs> like, like, like an airport. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I've definitely had drinks earlier. I've taken shots at 6 before. I've taken shots I at 6. They don't, they don't, you know what's crazy? In uh, Canada, I don't know if it's changed, but last, not the last time, but a couple times ago, I had got there super early. And Canada? I, yeah, it was in Toronto. The air pack, I mean, airport was so packed, they wouldn't let you check in or stand in line for your flight to go through security until it was like an hour before your flight. Oh so I had gosh. got there super early because it's international and tell you to go yeah. three hours before. So I checked my bags and all that, and I w tried to go stand in line, and they was like, no, you got to wait. Like, you need to come back in an hour and a half. I was like, an hour? What the fuck am I supposed to do for an hour and a half? So I was like, fuck it, you know what? I'm going to go have a drink. Went over there, and I was like, yeah, our bars don't open to no nigga. What? In, airport, in the airport? What? Yes. I thought that was like that and casinos were the only Bro, places you could really they drink was in the morning. <laughs> on your boy, so I'm just, I was like, I hate this fucking country. <laughs> no, <that's>, yes. <laughs> it's dumb, B. I'm ready to get fucked up. Yeah, I gotta it's, wait. It's been many times I've been on the early flight and I'm like, let me go grab a drink real quick. Real quick. It's the easiest thing to do. Yeah. I did not know that. The bars really be open that early in the airport? What? Yeah. I, had this, no I go to the Sky Club and go get for breakfast. I get some oatmeal, <clears> some of those eggs, and four mimosas. So by the time I get on the plane, I am right. All I need is four more mimosas on the plane. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Straight off. You ain't got to pee at all of this? I feel like I would be going back and forth to the bathroom well, I, just, so I, don't, I don't Yeah, pee. I do that. First I, class I, I has a nice eat. bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> the same one, uh, girl. I, I, I will is it? It don't change. <laughs> I'll fall asleep and I'll wake up and then I'll go pee. Because once I pee, I know I'm breaking the seal. So I'm going to have to go like yeah. three oh more gosh. times. Is that real? Yeah. 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 Once you break the seal, it's a wrap. Oh, That's man. why I never really, I never have been big on drinking because in college, when I would drink, it was I was always a person that was in line at the bathroom, nah, and I spent half the party in hold the bathroom because I had to keep peeing. It was really that much. Yes, yeah. literally. Yeah. When I went, uh, I went to Vegas the other day. I literally was on the plane. I was like, let me get two shots real quick. Mm -hmm. and my, they was bored, and I was like, All right. shots made you pee. No, I held it. I was like, I'm not gonna break the seal. And when yeah. I landed in Vegas, I was like, I gotta pee. I got to say, yeah. I feel like you would also pee shots like. Pss. <laughs> nah. I wish. If only. Down the I wish it was like that. Nah, man, I be peeing. Y'all ever had a really long pee? You be like, oh my god. Long? I've had a pee so long, I thought I was gonna die. And I was like, this ain't, this ain't normal, right. bro. No, you know, and I knew I was gonna pee a long time. I counted it. It was almost a minute I peed. Damn. You straight, so straight, after, before, Like after you exhale, you be like, I still got pee. Well, let me inhale again. Yes. Like, I got 
I peed and it stopped and finished up again. I mean, started up again. I was like, all right, I need to go get checked, bro. It does seem weird like, when you're just like, I'm still peeing. If you ever try to pee really long. over your boxers, like instead of coming through the hole, you just like pull it on top and try to pee like that. And it and seems it's like it's going pressure. like this. Yeah, it's a little pressure on it. You be like, all right, I'm done. And then as soon as you lift it, try to put it back in, you be like, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Oh, yeah. I almost peed on myself like, so oh, many times. You better I've, get your prostate checked. I've spotted Daddy. my boxers before. Yeah. <laughs> spotted? You're like, spotted. all done. It's like the, the band was the always, dick is always like, like this. The dick, the dick is always like, wait, 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 wait. And you're like, hey, I'm walking out. Wait, I, wait. So you don't feel that? Like you don't do an extra pee? Like when you pee? Yeah, sometimes. I mean, most times. Okay, yeah, you're done, you, and then you're like, okay, a little more. That's yeah, you stand there for a second, shake, and then there's wait more. For, and yeah, then you go I in. Think and you're like, like, wait, 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 wait. Because like, when, you, when you're peeing, you're going like this, right? And then when you put it back in your boxes, you just like that. So gravity is just like, all right. Oh, uh, I see. That's all I can think of. I don't know what it was. I don't know. But you know what? I did read somewhere when you pee, you don't. You don't empty your entire bladder. There's always something left. Why? That's, why are you made know. like that? That's so know. weird. That's why y'all boxes be mad pee. Somebody smell <laughs> like, this is, My boxes never smell like straight <laughs> Whose urine. Do you smell? <laughs> I smell some pee pee boxes. And it smelled like urine or it smelled like. Like, like you be like, you pee on yourself? Mm-hmm. Yeah, like oh, that nigga might have peed on himself. That nigga might have peed on himself, though. If you could just be down in that general area and be like, that was he homeless? Is it a transient? Did he eat asparagus? Picked up a nigga on the subway. Somebody said spotted in the boxes, like you said, and it's. It looks different than when, when you, you said it. Sp- it looks oh, like, that's it like looks a period like, thing? Yes. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I know how I said it. <laughs> <laughs> I spotted, I I wouldn't spotted put that my boxes with some urine. <laughs> just a little, it's just a little right, urine. we got to go ahead and wrap up, though. <laughs> Um, yeah, we got a, we got another podcast of coming in after that, and then the food's gonna be here. And we got to set up, and they got to change all of that. So I'm okay, we don't need time. all your explanations. Yeah, we. I just right. I just said, oh, we did. Yeah. <laughs> I see the time. I was just trying to be surprised. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm an actor. <laughs> 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 like, what are we done? Oh, ready? Oh my God! It was so bad. It was so bad. All right, well, yeah, uh, for five podcasts straight, man, this flew by. <laughs> right? It did. It did. Yeah. <laughs> Except you only did three, nigga. Right. <laughs> to here and I. Yeah. Right. Man, man. We did. I am tired. Woo. Anyway, I, I want to thank our special guest, uh, Meg Scoo, for coming on for our first time. And Lulu for always pulling up with amazing energy. Both of you guys. Oh, welcome fun, back guys. Thank you. time. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Shout out to the Scary Squad. They in the comments. Shout out to Young Deuces, PA, MTM TV, Sherry Barnes, Woo. Hippie Ghost, Chris Sullivan is here, Kevin Smith is here, uh, Lady Blue is here. She came and saw me in Orlando. We had a great time at that show. Hey. Uh, <laughs> Miss Joyce is here. It's a lot of y'all. Talia is here. Shout out to all the Scary Squad that pulled yeah. up. Definitely appreciate y'all and all the other people because it's, it's 37 people watching, just not everybody comments. Oh, wow. So. Uh, we appreciate y'all for tapping in and all of that type of stuff, man. And we'll see y'all next week. I'm to hear more. I'm Patrick Cloud. And this is another episode of Damn Internet, You Scary. Come on, as Lulu would say. <laughs> Damn Internet, You Scary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We out this bitch. Holla. Bye. Bye.